Here, let's take a uh, uh, let's let's lighten the mood by hearing what Geraldo Rivera believes is the um, is woman's greatest asset in a marriage. I'm playing this for you, Nikki. Jada, Smith, Jada Pinkett Smith and Will Smith both said divorce is not an option. And if we say that it is, then we're going to go in knowing that there can be a failure. And we don't want to go Geraldo, how many times have you been married? I've been married for 11 years with Erica, August 2nd. I want to state that first. But I had a lot of beta marriages, Andrea, before that. <laughs> do, do you, I had four divorces. Do you think that if you were la able to do a beta marriage, you well, probably wouldn't have so many let me Let me approach that uh, from a different direction. Uh -huh. I'm the father of three daughters. Mm -hmm. And I hate this idea. Why do I hate this idea? And I, I know that, that this may re a Stephen Smith-like reaction, mm. uh, but I think essentially, uh, although there's an increase in, in two-income marriages, generally speaking, uh, it's, uh, um, the man is the breadwinner more often than not, although now increasingly women do work. But I think that what a woman brings to a marriage more than anything else to a relationship is her youth. Her youth is a fragile and, uh, and diminishing uh, 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 resource. So if a woman were to invest two years in one of these marriages and then to be rejected by the man, I, I think that she has given up a valuable asset that is unequal. I wish there was a words, camera on Jedediah's face right <laughs> now. I'm like, this right words, now. In other words, the, the man gets everything and the woman gets nothing oh, from this. Oh, event. I don't know. But, but here's God. the thing. Millennials, are they just being realistic? Are they there you have. Your youth, uh, women, is your most valuable asset. Don't give that up in the context of marriage. I think he must be talking about childbearing. Yeah, I can't figure out exactly what he's talking about. Just insane. It's crazy. Unbelievable. Um, all right, so let's talk a little bit about it. Was it. funny to watch him realize, sort of mid sentence, like, yeah. oh, "Oh, wait a second, this I, is not so good." I've just compared about what I'm about. Listen, if you've got to compare what you're about to say to a guy who just talked about uh, that women may deserve domestic abuse, you really, and that's when he referenced yeah. the Stephen Smith. When you say, like, I may get, this may be like, you know, that time Stephen Smith, you know, had to apologize for saying that women may deserve domestic abuse. You know what you should do at that point? Even if you're on live TV, you should say, you know what, actually, I just thought better of it. I really just have thought better about what I was just about to say. 